Well, hello guys, hello, hello, welcome back to the Big Fat Psychic channel. I'm so pleased to be reading again for you today. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Thank you for uh, all your messages. Uh, you know, I, I've really enjoyed making uh, the videos as we do. Uh, I'm loving uh, the uh, new subscriber rate going up. You know, it's not necessarily, I'm probably the only one that says you don't have to subscribe. But, you know, at the end of the day, it's your view that counts to me. Okay, so... Uh, and YouTube, if you look at me a lot, then you know I go forever up, don't I? And it's obviously having some effect uh, as well. So, uh, just a garden update. Uh, ugh, it's pissing down, and I'm telling you now, I ain't gone all this way for about four months, five months uh, of graft to show my garden without me painted plant pots that I made. Okay, uh, I just thought a bit so. Uh, spare wood but uh, I, do, I just have to tell you something quickly all right I know you like me to get into it but uh, it's regarding the garden so I've been doing a few hours in it uh, last night and I needed to do it last night because it's all the lights and the electrics and everything and you know you have to be real careful don't you so uh, and there's quite a lot of uh, uh, electrics so yeah I was just uh, checking on them and, and finishing off little bits uh, Anyway, I get to say, oh, so please, you know, if you can be in love with your garden, you know, <laughs> that's me. But it's not the garden, it's not the material, it's about putting an idea into my head uh, out there and making it real. And that is the true magic uh, of anything. So, you know, it could be anything, mine was just the garden. Anyway, so I was uh, full of it, you know, excitement and everything, can't wait, uh, get sat down. Anyway, there was some police cars turned up down the... Uh, just around the corner, but you could see him. And, uh, oh, I was having a nose ache. Well, I was making such a racket, actually, so I had a nose ache, uh, and uh, I was watching him, and I thought, oh, they're going in people's gardens. Well, it was only about six houses from man, and I was like, <laughs> spread myself with the deodorant, up. Oh, they're coming this way, you know, I can't wait. I'm showing them the garden. They love it. They're walking and think, oh, my God, it's like a TARDIS come paradise. <laughs> Anyway, uh, they, they caught the person down the snicket, which is one house away. <laughs> I was so disappointed. So disappointed. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I really was and, uh, and I stayed up 20 minutes uh, extra as well just to watch them chasing somebody in there you know looking at uh, six coppers all with a pencil torch really <laughs> a pencil torch oh my god I've seen uh, you know bigger torches uh, used by the opticians <sighs> they're my things anyway okay so we're gonna get into it uh, so no you know the motto is you're not getting this photo until my plant box is uh, uh, finished and I'll have to wait till it stops raining uh, for a day or two at least so oh the road <laughs> anyway okay so we did the daily mail versus uh megan uh to see where they was coming from okay it looks like uh oh there's something come you know and they see it really really like well, they, don't you think there was no tower cars there was no devil cars there was no the fall you know there was all you know they're all like pretty shit cards really uh depending on what you're making of it but yeah uh, i just feel like oh let's get into it anyway i always get adrift right okay uh, how's megan feeling uh, about uh i'll shuffle them in front of you because i use these uh the last time as well but just do them again yeah how's megan feeling uh about the uh mail online case you know overall what's it what's her opinion does she think she went Oh, what I said. Was there, how, how was you feeling? Okay, well, I certainly see a judge there. I see a judge. So, uh, for some reason, something is being said between uh, her lawyers and the judge. She's taking charge. She's absolutely thinking she's going to wipe the floor with them, you know. Uh, she is so confident uh, as well. Uh, and she's uh, she's ready to uh, stand up for herself and fight. But I also think that, you know, like I said, I see the judge. I worry here, okay. I worry at this point that she thinks... Uh, 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 everything is going to be okay. I think as well, though, she's like, she's kind of involved in it, okay, in, in, but she's got a lawyer doing it, so she's not defending herself, but she is instructing uh, her team, and she has got some of the best lawyers you can, but, you know, it, it, 
some of the best lawyers okay trying to uh keep it close so she, i think maybe uh is she asking just for the judge to make a decision again like they freaking did uh, there last time you know is this possible that's what she's going to uh you know aim for what does megan hope to uh, achieve in this uh lawsuit She wants to uh, take him down, you know. Uh, Megan does not construct uh, healthy things and for the right reason. Uh, she's not doing things uh, for the right reason. You know, she thinks uh, it it's kind of ruins her as well. D oh, she might go for damages or, you know, something stupid. Uh, I, I know all about the old rubbish. I'm talking about this could, This is something new, okay. Uh, so Megan can't construct her way out of this. She has to sort of like uh, follow it through. I think she wants to wreck it, you know, she wants to wreck it, she wants to destabilise it, uh, she wants to uh, take them down, you know, she wants to uh, make them pay, she wants to uh, bamboozle them, you know, confuse them, uh, mislead them, she wants the downfall, okay, she does not want them to win whatsoever and she's willing uh, to, to do it. I wonder, I don't think she knows who this person is, okay, but we'll see, we'll see. So, you know, I think Megan wants to break her, you know, she wants to break them, she wants to break the internet, she wanted to break up the royal family, she wants to break her, her dad's heart, you know, she wants to break her everything, doesn't she, uh, you know. So, what does she hope to achieve? Yeah, to to take them down, to 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 win. How how does she intend to do this then? How does Megan intend to try and bring down, um, you know, the car? Now the other thing as well, you know, I have to say this because it's popped into my head. She has that looking down, and she has it looking up, and at all times. Uh, with this court case, she may want to bring him down, but she'll find another way to construct a plan against the royal family and the Queen. How how does Meghan intend to, to do this? How does Meghan intend to do this, please? By lying. By silencing people, okay? By lying, by hunting them down and frightening them, by causing them, you know, to feel uh, suffering. Do you know what? This woman has got blonde hair. I said to her a few readings ago uh, when I saw with the lion trying to, someone trying to calm uh, Megan or tame her. Blonde hair, blonde hair. And I'm still seeing it now uh, as well. Uh, so, yeah, it's uh, underhand. It's stuff that we won't know about. So that's how she's going to uh, go uh, about it. And as well, you know, I do feel at this time, with this point, uh, she has people helping her. I worry about the judge. I really do. I worry about uh, the judge. I worry the judge is uh, so like the way of viewing it is not as important as it is to us you know what i mean i don't know you know <coughs> she's gonna lie isn't she she's gonna lie excuse me <coughs> she's gonna ask for uh information not to be revealed you know she's asking uh, for it to uh, be silent and sealed and all this crap you know what i mean Oh, it's just uh, unbelievable. I worry about the judge. I really do. Now, don't forget, if you listen to the questions, it's hope, uh, you know, is it, uh, how will. So, uh, we don't know yet. Uh, what is uh, Megan's uh, next move regarding this court case, please? She wants to kill it off. She wants to end it. She wants to end it, okay? Uh, she'll have been told to, to pull out, you know. <coughs> She's going to say, I've had enough. 
uh, and that's that because their PR team would say you know you don't want this you do not uh, want this at all okay so uh, Meg, maybe um, I know she definitely wants an end to it I tell you now she wants an end to it she, you know she's saying I've had enough I've had enough What will be the uh, consequences then, uh, you know, of this mail on S Sunday, mail online, daily mail, whatever it is, uh, you know, what will be the consequences uh, for uh, Megan? She's uh, she's delusional. She's delusional. Okay, uh, it's delusional. I tell you what, she'll get so many uh, pieces out, so many uh, fluff pieces from her end. But I also say, you know, uh, this is where uh, the, the there are no dreams. I think her, her dreams will be uh, shattered. Something gets shattered. Maybe uh, not shut on. Shattered. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, uh, illusion, just illusion. You know, she's de she's delusional. When that's a bright, you know, that's uh, attempts to sort of like making stories up, embellishing them, adding to them, you know, uh, rumors, creating rumors or, or stuff like that. Uh, where is this? I think stuff could come out the way woodwork. I think she's damned if she does uh, and damned if she doesn't, okay? But whatever illusion she's going to be giving you, uh, you must know. It's not real. It's not real. So if she's upset, it's not real. And if she's happy about it, it's not real, okay? So it'll be the opposite to, to what she uh, portrays. Who will be a uh, public uh, opinion again about Megan and Harry and the court case? No. What will be uh, the outcome? Public, sorry, public opinion uh, regarding uh, Megan and the uh, male. I think, uh, you know, you're going to get a few conspiracy theories, uh, yeah, you know, seeing stuff that really isn't there. Uh, people letting off steam uh, as well. Uh, so they will be quite vocal uh, about it. I don't see it as uh, particularly good. But, I mean, it's not an evil uh, one. It's a bad press, a bad press. I'm getting a bad press. Uh, so they will get a bad press. I think we'll give them a, a bad press uh, as well. I think we'll feel cheated, actually. If she pulls out, I think, uh, you know, I don't know if it's possible, by the way, and you say what they say. And sometimes, you know, things uh, do become uh, that, even though at the start we think, all oh, right. Anyway, that wasn't a very good analogy, was it? Yeah, uh, letting off steam, uh, you know, for practices, uh, thinking she's been winding some of her, constructing things that she's responsible. She's got this uh, wheel uh, turning uh, this machine, you know, it's not your best card for public opinion and it's not your worst, you know. Okay, outcome uh, for Megan then. Will Megan uh, win her uh, case against the male? <laughs> no. No, no, no. But I, I would get that she expected this. Uh, you know, she expected this. Uh, the, the tower card is like a shock. Comes out of nowhere, you know. Or usually when they're uh, doing things and delivering, uh, you know, aggro. Uh, so will she win? I, I would say no. She might get a small success uh, of something. But overall, no, we're not seeing her as a, a winner at all. Uh, and I think she's been told to expect this. Will anything come out uh, regarding...
Will anything be exposed uh, in this uh, sort of like legal uh, argument? Uh, will anything be exposed? Will the male expose anything uh, untoward about Megan? They know something. This is when it's upright. Don't know. Wishy washy. Uh, not sure. Haven't aired yet. Okay, so the fact that this is reversed, I'm going to say that they do know something. They absolutely uh, do know something. Uh, they're waiting. They're waiting. They're waiting. They've got something. Right then, so, well, I don't know. Make of that uh, what you will. Um, obviously, it looks like, uh, you know, the Daily Mail get what they want. Okay, I saw, saw a lot more positive cards there, but I don't see really any uh, fear uh, about Megan. She's just slight and cunning uh, through this, okay? I'm not seeing her too worried, uh, you know, and what little surprise there, there is, maybe court costs or something like that, uh, she is uh, expecting but, well, don't know. The male is interesting, isn't it? All that came out. So let's uh, let's wait and see. Let's wait and see. How strange, okay? How strange that it's in their side. And it's not uh, in Megan's. Does Megan have any idea uh, that the male online uh, have uh, information regarding her pregnancies? Supposedly. No, she, she ain't got a clue, you know. Uh, as far as uh, she's concerned, the relationship breaking down uh, is due that it wasn't uh, working. It didn't go the way she wants. She doesn't feel like they, they did a good job at all. Uh, so, <laughs> Megan, Megan, Megan. Woohoo, something's coming. And it's close. We're seeing it in a few readings lately. So, you know, it must be coming uh, close. Okay. Right then. So, on that note, uh, I am uh, going to uh, go. And uh, thank you very much. Uh, I'll be back uh, soon. We've got the uh, live shows Halloween tomorrow. So, please don't forget that. Uh, log on if you want. Ask anything. You know, it's not, not or just observe, you know. Uh, it can be anything. Meg, Harry, earthquakes, whatever. Uh, your, your family, you know, deceased. Private reading. Well, uh, not private, but a general uh, reading on your whatever you want to know. Okay. You ask a question and I answer it. Okay. Uh, so, it's been great, guys. Thank you very much. Bye now. Bye-bye.